Up, buddy nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Killer Shark in Another World Chapter 13. So before I get into this recap and live reaction, let me just remind you to hit the like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because of course this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored and I'm just on a non-stop high-speed struggle train heading into chaos. It's getting faster by the second. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive and kicking, Feel free to hit up my Cash App and PayPal. Those links are in the description box below. So, you know what? Instead of me giving a recap, I'm just going to read the recaps for um, Killer Shark in Another World that's given to me right here. Because these recaps are just fucking everything. So, without further ado, let's get to this. Previously, in Killer Shark in Another World. As the battle between uh, Same and the giant Pactos, a.k.a. the Kraken, intensifies, this motherfucker just destroyed the Golden Gate Bridge. No, it is the Golden Gate Bridge! Kitty, that's, that, that's the bridge to one of the bridges to my hometown! No, that's motherfucker, why? Um, the Demon Lord's, the Demon Lord Army Sea Monster is still no match for the strongest motherfucker, a.k.a. Same. Wow, the strongest motherfucker is once again victorious, and the giant Pactos is now nothing more than shark shit. <laughs> what they fucking recaps? <laughs> I don't need to give my own personal recaps, but this is right here. Like, why would I need? Why would I do my own recaps when this is here? Like, seriously. Ah, this is shark shit. This is pure cuteness. Look at these keys, and Sharky. Sharky is so cute. Sharky is so cute. Look He's like, no, I can't do Kion. Kion! Kion! I won't do that. You only meow. You only meow and try to, like, uh, be all cute to get what, what you want from me, huh? I love you, cat. Even though you're a fussy kitty and wake me up at, like, 2 in the morning. I swear to God, this cat will wake me up at 2 in the morning because he wants to play fetch. Woo! <laughs> I can't breathe. I'm going to die. Father, mother, I'm so sorry. I'm so unfortunate in life. Oh, my God. Don't think you could just leave this motherfucker behind and go on, uh, go on ahead to the afterlife. And this chapter is titled, Even Same is Surprised at um, Hamanapa. Oh my god, I can't. Hamanapa. Oh my god. Oh my god, try and say this three times. Um, Hamanapa, there we go. Even Same is Surprised at Hamanapa. Let's go. Oh, here we are. I'm still alive. Mother, I'm so sorry. Once again, my new P has failed to die. Remember, she like the daughter of, an, of um, I'm guessing Anubis and... No, she'd be the daughter of Osiris and um, Isis. There we go. Yes, that's what it seems like to me. But do look at Zari, so cute. Because she's a new P, so Anubis, ha. Huh. Eh? Huh? Newbie chan? Yeah, yeah? Whoa, I'm so sorry that I was about to die! Yeah, I can <laughs> Look at so cute! Yes, it was regrettable. Hey, Sami, you also apologize to her. Apologize! Bad boy, bad, bad boy! Now apologize, Sami! What? <laughs> Just bear! Nyang! It hurts, it um, shiromi sign Is it okay if I touch the, also touch the god of death? Eh? Ah! <laughs> That's all you have in this shit. Wow! Oh, I'm so sorry, Nuki Chan. He saw me bad boy to even do that to a princess. Grr. I'm so sorry, Your Highness. This child is simply in a bad mood. Oh. Huh, it's okay. It's not Nuki Chan's fault. I'll let you touch him later when he's in a better mood. Really? She really wanted to touch Sami that she was about to, to, to cry about it. You've been through so much scary stuff. Why? Of course. Grr. Nuki Chan is a princess, so I don't really uh, know what she's really thinking about. What a mysterious girl. You bastard, what the hell are you? Uh, what the hell did you do to Nuki 
me sorry, uh, Sama. Well, I'm so sorry. Our plan got screwed up, but we managed to land on the west coast. But thanks to the, that shark, we've lost our ship as well as our supplies. What should we do, uh, Massa Sama? We've already sent some troops to the neighboring villages. We're uh, currently negotiating with them to share some of their uh, food in exchange for money. Well, that'll be easy. It'll be really expensive because it's San Francisco. Um, there might be some pursuers from the Demon Lord's army. We'll leave as soon as we're ready. Every second counts. Me? What? I'm really in a foreign country now. Uh, country. How exciting! Uh, what? Wait a minute. You're telling me that the Golden Gate Bridge is a gateway to Hamanopla Kingdom. So it is a, a it, so the underworld is there? Are you fucking serious? San Franciscans, you know what? I ain't surprised. This is why I'm not surprised because there's hella people that commit suicide off that bridge. There were so many people that they, um, I think there's like netting under the bridge now to stop people from trying to commit suicide. <laughs> oh my God, this, you know what? This does not surprise me. I'm surprised, but I'm not surprised, and I and like in the best way possible. I think this is really kind of cool. <laughs> I love that there is a fucking gate to the underworld where I grew, where I was born. Yes, and technically I lived there for a year too. You know what? That might explain why. I'm a, a, well, I know tectonic plates and all that shit. I know, but California might have more earthquakes because the underworld is there too. If you read Percy Jackson books, you know that Hades is in L.A. So that's why I'm like, I can believe this. I'm not mad. Look, look how cute and zombie is. It's so big. Cute, cute. Whoa. Um, this is amazing. This is my first time abroad. Ah, oh, cute. Um, is it here? The place with the bridge? Is this where we are right now? That, that's right. This is our current location. Um, we will be crossing this uh, here desert from here. Um, then we will be heading to uh, Maya Maya Dungeon. Maya Maya Dungeon? Huh? Dungeon? Isn't it a place where adventurers frequently visit? The one where there are tons of amazing items and treasures hidden inside them? Those, those dungeons, right? Why are we heading to a dungeon? Aren't we fighting the Demon Lord's army? Things are not that simple. Our country is now under attack by the Demon Lord's army, but it's not a frontal confrontation. The enemy has invaded by means beyond uh, what we've imagined. By the time we've realized, it was already too late. The kingdom of um, Hamanpala is a powerful country with um, a world-class military and economic strength. Dude, that palace is beautiful. We were able to stop the Demon Lord army's invasion, which began 10 years ago until today. Dude, this is boss. It was because of uh, Hamanpala's military strength, but... That's not the only main contributor. He is known as the Beast. Oh, he's known as the Beast King I Imhotep. Oh, I am not surprised by this. Not surprised. King Imho's uh, command was so fierce that he even went to the front lines himself and overwhelmed the Demon Lord's army. The br his bravery was so uh, so great that it even spread to the sub surrounding com uh, countries. And his subjects trusted him so much that we thought that our country's, country's defense to be rock solid. The king also happens to be... <gasps> really? My father? Really? I'm kind of shooketh by this. Really? It's not a it's not Osiris? But in her death? Hmm. Hold on a sec, this is gonna bug me. This will very much bug me. I had to double check and make sure. I was I I knew that this seemed wrong. Ha! He it says here, because I had to double check. It says, there's a few ways you can do this. You could say, for parentage-wise, you could say son of Ra, um, or uh, son of um, either later, uh, in the, which period was this? There's another one that says that um, another tradition is the son of, of either the cow goddess Hasat or the cat goddess Bastet. 
and another tradition depicted him as the son of Ra and Nephetis. And then the Greek Plutarch stated that Anubis was the illegitimate son of um, Nephetis and Osiris, but that he was adopted by Osiris's wife, um, Isis. But that's why I'm just like, wait, something just does not seem right. And when he, when she, um, they said that her father was in hotel, I was like, what? Doesn't seem right. But, um, but Impui is definitely right. It is. The name is right. It does. Because, um, that's what, uh, is known for. Uh, that's not known for. It was known as. Uh, Anubis was known as. So that is fine. But parent-wise, that is weird. Hold on. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. Wait. That's, ha, huh, I was thinking it was set. I was thinking set, okay, set is one of them. That's what the other one I was thinking as well was, was possibly set. But no, Inhotep is not set. But, mm. no, this scene is either. Unless you're saying that, in, unless you're saying Inhotep is set, which I could believe, then I, I don't, no, nah, this don't make sense. I could believe that he, that maybe he set, that King Inhotep is set. But I don't think that's the case. No. Nah. But anyway, I'm curious what you guys have, think. My father is the sole king. He doesn't let anyone come uh, near him or trust anyone, even me, his own child. King Imho is really a strong ruler, as it should have been. Um, he doesn't even open uh, up to his uh, immediate family. Nubi let... Uh, oh, oh, my God. He doesn't even open up to his uh, immediate family, Nubi, let alone us, royal guards. But if he's uh, such a strong king, you don't have to worry about anything, right? Why are you trying to flee? That's because the king has changed and is acting weird. No. That thing is not my father. That thing is at the golden city of Hamu. Wah! Here, here, over here. Um, ooh, is it here? Wait, wait, I won't let you get away from me. I got you. Ooh, he is, he, I got you now. Ooh, he enjoying the ladies. Ah, as expected of his highness, as expected of his highness. Ain't that right? This country is mine. Um, King of uh, Hamnapala Kingdom, Imhotep uh, Hamnapala. Um, there's absolutely nothing I cannot grant. Um, wah! Your Highness, me too. There's something that I want. Oh, what do you want, my cuties? Just ask me anything. Yeah, thank you so much, Your Highness. I want a diamond ring. Oh, kitties, what do you want, kitties? You just want a hug, huh? You want a hug and a snuggle. Right, kitties? Or you want your belly rubbed? Um, a really big one around this big. This big. I want silk tresses, a hundred pieces. I want a villa for so, um, uh, it says summing. I think it's supposed to be sunning. Damn, your translator, you're sunning in the sea. Wow, what, what? Are you making fun of me? Just who do you think I am? Is that all you wanted? Man, you girls are so unselfish. Whoa, what? Dude. <gasps> Sell. That's Cell! Holy shit, it's Cell! Woo! This will be your last wish before you die, bitches! Woo! Shouldn't you fucking whores be more selfish? Dude, Cell! Cell! Yeah! Wah! Yeah! Run from Cell, bitches! I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry! Please forgive me! Woo! Oh God! Whoa! Are you done? Well, well, well. Sorry to keep you waiting. I've already ha heard what happened. I'm sure you must have been mortified as fuck. Am I right, Captain Davy? There's nothing to be ashamed of. You've been bitten by one big motherfucker. What the fuck did you say? Um. Epinanel and uh, Zelda, Zaldan are both fucking dead, you fucking dickhead. What? The Oak Squads were totally defeated. I am aware. Those dumbasses have already informed me about it. Ah, help me, um, Egerton. Oh my god. Help me, Egerton. I couldn't believe my ears. E I couldn't believe my ears either, though both of them don't have that many troops. What kind of demon do you have to be to lose to, um, your life to such a weak nation? 
It was a shark who killed both of them. But that's just not just any motherfucking shark. That shark can turn itself into the biggest motherfucker you've ever seen. It can swim on land. It can fly in the sky. And it seems like that motherfucker can devour anything. Dude, this pail is fucking lit. I love this pail. It seems to be a summoner's familiar and also an enemy of our demon lord's army. You've already got fucked in the ass by that motherfucker, haven't you? You fucking dude, he just called him a chode. Oh my god, you fucking chode. Oh my god. I already know where that bitch princess is heading, Davy Show. You just keep um, blockading the sea and keep jacking off in the sidelines with your left hand. <laughs> that is an imperial command. <laughs> you're like an asshole. You're getting way too over your head. Only the demon lord is allowed to be called the king of this world. Have you stepped into the human world so much that you forgot about your loyalty? Of course, my comrade. I haven't forgotten about it. Oh my god, I'm the scorpion king! Ooh, the rock is up in this bitch. Can you smell what the rock is cooking? It's the scorpion king! I am the Scorpion King, a being who transcends death, cursed to be a walking plague. Just leave that motherfucker to me. Ooh, the rock is gonna try and fuck with Same, huh? With my power, I'm gonna turn that motherfucking shark into grains of sand of this of uh, this godforsaken kingdom. <laughs> a repulsive sand king who looks nothing like <laughs> chapter are you ready for this i don't even know if the rock ready for this <laughs> i swear if we see if we see the rock up in this bitch i'm going to die oh, the, oh my god this shit dude i'm just fucking dead i am dead i'm dead i i love this this is great <laughs> Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdy Can Sync. If you love what I'm doing, I want to help keep this um, channel alive and kick it so I can keep bringing you more Killer Shark and another world uh, content. A few ways you can do that. Donate to my Cash App, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.